it's just another whirlwind adventure. Oh, hey guys. So I'm uh, walking on the street. Got myself a little nai cha here, a little milk tea. And uh, today we're going to be looking for some good noodles, uh, which I suppose is a version of noodling. Yeah, why not? I just coined it. Anyway, so let's go see what we can find. So I suppose there's many different varieties of noodles out there as there are Legos. And every one of them will hurt your feet if you step on them. But I wanted to find something specific. I saw these noodles a few months back that had these uh, peanuts and these little sour beans and meat. And unfortunately, since I, I don't know the words for them in Chinese, I've been looking all over for them. And I heard a rumor that they were on the other side of town. So here's the rub. There very well may be 500 places like this in my town selling the exact same noodles. But not knowing means I have to trape all across town for these noodles. But for only 5 by a bowl, it's more an adventure than an inconvenience. Okay, so I definitely was interested in the eggs. And while this corner noodle shop may look all Flintstones, I assure you the noodles here are absolutely fantastic as the proprietor lady makes each bowl individually with just the right amount of cabbage, meat, noodles, and some little sour beans with peanuts. Wonderful! After she had bagged up my noodles to go, but cleverly I might add, using the chopsticks as a barrier between the two stacked bowls so as to not melt the plastic lids, it seemed like too nice a day to take my noodles home. So I found myself a bus, took a short ride the other direction, looking for a semi-quiet picnic spot where I can enjoy my noodles while they were still hot. Okay, so the side of the road next to a fruit market, a bakery, and hey man, nice abs, may not seem like the ideal picnic spot. In China, it's as good as it gets. Many shops have picnic tables right out front, so as long as you don't mind the occasional person looking at you while you eat, it's actually quite nice. They say a picture is worth a thousand words, but words alone really can't describe how worth the wait these were. Even the guy brushing his teeth next to the road did nothing to diminish these noodles. Well, I appreciate you guys watching. Like anything else, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, stay frosty. Never mind the fact that this bathroom probably has not been cleaned since Nikita Khrushchev was in office. 
The fact that you have the urinals right next to a plate glass window over a park where children play seems like a design flaw, don't you think?